yeah, there's just no better feeling than, than getting in, in behind the wheel of the race car and, you know, making it dance. So my father used to say anyways, just go out there and make that car dance. Um, I'm not much of a dancer, to be honest with you, but I don't know, I, I can make the car dance. So that, that matters. Who, what, where, and why? Who? Kyle Marcelli, a.k.a. Casper. They also call me the Nighthawk. Uh, on weekends, I drive race cars, weekdays, generally sleep in, you know, have a glass of warm milk every once in a while. Where am I? Uh, we're in the United States of America. Uh, I seem to spend more time here than I do in Canada. I kind of forget what my bed looks like, to be honest. I, I just remember my bed was white. It was white sheets. I just felt like an angel when I sleep in there. We are, uh, we're here racing, driving race cars, and you know, it's what I love. I've, it's all I've ever thought about, and uh, it's my passion, my dream. I, I don't know what it is, but it's, uh, it's fun, it's fast, you know, it's exhilarating. He always used to tell me also, you know, one eye on the car in front of you, one eye off the road, and I never, still can't understand what he was talking about. Like, it's a little odd to have one eye on the car in front of you and one eye off the road. It's, um, I'm still trying to wrap my head around what he means about that one. Race car drivers, I mean, they're chick magnets, and, you know, girls are just trying to get a hold of you at all, every minute of the day. It's, it, it's a bit crazy, actually. Um, just this year I brought on a, an assistant because, um, you know, just, you need, you, need, you need to keep the girls away, they're a distraction. Every minute of the day, Kyle, Kyle, can I get your autograph, Kyle, you know, sign this, Kyle. It's, it's uh, I, I have nightmares at night. I think the hardest part about racing cars is, it's the mornings. I mean, man, there's some early mornings. I'm a night owl. I'm, I'm the night hawk. I sort of know my way around in this world by Starbucks locations, really, you know. A lot of people nowadays use their iPhones or Androids or, you know, whatever you call them. But uh, for me, it's Starbucks locations. I mean, honestly, when I think about it, there's, there's not a lot bad about driving a race car. But the worst part, um, probably passing gas. There's nowhere for it to go, nowhere. If you ever pass gas in a race suit, it just immediately comes right into your helmet, and it's bad. I can recall earlier this weekend, actually, coming into turn three, I slipped one out. And my eyeballs watering in the brake zone. I don't know what else to do about it. I, I try, I try not, try not drinking coffee, but I love coffee. I don't know. Yeah, I'm gonna have to get a ventilation system. I gotta talk to OMP about that, actually. See if we can get a system that just sort of vents a little better. 